I don't want yes guys. I want guys that are gonna challenge me. And, uh, and that's why I even want a guy like Paul Pressey. He could finish my sentence off before I start. I mean, we're like, it's kind of like your brothers from another mother. That's what we are, brothers from another mother. Mike and I was roommates at Tulsa. We've been best of buddies. Our kids grew up together. We vacationed together. Our whole family just grew up together. And one of the things he always talked about, you know, if there was an opportunity to, to come and, and be on the bench, which I would love to do that. St. John called him or made contact with him on a Wednesday. He called me Wednesday night. Pablo, I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, I've spoken to St. John. I'll keep you posted. I said, all right, cool. Next day, he calls me back that evening. He said, you got your bags packed. I said, I keep my bags packed. I keep a winter bag and a summer bag. It happened that quick. And in a day and a half, they hired him. Maybe a month or six weeks later, I came on board. I told Mike the first opportunity I got with him, I said, I have one agenda. I said, it helped you build a team to a championship opportunity. And I said, and that's what I'm all about. I said, if you need me to step behind the bench, up in the stands, you need me to be the fifth, the sixth, the seventh guy, it does not matter. How can I help? And he said, well, I want you to come in and mentor my players. I want you to talk to them about the pros and cons on and off the court. Give them some of your experience as a pro player, as a college player. Talk to my staff the same way. And, uh, and that's what I've done. I value you know, his coaching pedigree. And he's had a chance to coach some of the best. And, uh, and I think that's so important on our basketball uh, staff. You need to have someone who's been there, done that. Because all our kids, they come with aspiration to play at the next level. Well, I got a guy that did it, coached it, scouted it, okay? He knows what an NBA player is. When I wake up in the morning, I said, this is what these guys need every day. It's a hug. It's just to tell them, it's okay. So what, you made some mistakes. You're gonna make mistakes in life. It's the important thing you do is after that, how do you deal with adversity? And that's part of my job and my motivation when I wake up in the morning. I thank Mike Anderson and I appreciate him for what he has done for me to allow me to have this on this coaching opportunity to learn Mike Anderson uh, on the college level and getting closer to the goal that he wants to get, get done. And uh, that's to win a championship.